guys welcome back to another m crater video so today we're going to be looking at just a quick a little announcement i don't do these that often on this channel but it's something that is noteworthy because you guys like the lore series so i wanted to just quickly announce that i have a repository that for the mod um i've changed the um unofficial m creator examples thing a little bit i've nested the mod under this particular uh repository down here so there's the feedback you can still provide feedback there's projects and uh then there is uh basically this one down here i've organized it a little bit more so it's a little bit neater you still have the pinned ones for the feedback where you can suggest stuff to my channel uh for advanced tutorials things like that i've actually reworked a lot of that um recently and then there's the projects one which has all the examples uh so if you scroll down a little bit more you have the tales of biome one but uh, you can also also just link the links directly to that repository here it's open sourced it's under the general public license 3.0 which means it's the same license as m creator and uh people can branch off the um uh, basically make their own version of the mod if they want uh, Again, the license is here if you want to read all that um, Not going to go into too much details. You can also click on the GPL license and it will basically bring you to the same place um, Other than that uh, there is a wiki um, Currently not a whole bunch on there. I'm looking for wiki contributors for the mod if anyone's interested then uh, contact me through email and I'll see if I can't um, get some people to work on documentation for the mod. Um, most of it's in video format, but uh, having text version with more details and stuff like that would probably be the best to actually have. So under issues, um, some of this is uh, for development. So I'll be keeping track of development things. Uh, they have tags for development. You can search by uh, closed, open, and I believe if you select what you're looking for under the labels you'll be able to sort all that out so if there's bugs then you can search for bugs or development bugs um you can do bugs and then disable development and then we can see that there's that so there's also feature request you can use this as a feature request system as well so if you create new issue you can suggest something or report a bug uh, that you find so that's another reason why i've opened up the mod to the public so they can uh, so people can actually help with finding the bugs before i go and release it it's going to be a while before i release the mod for sure but um having the extra help from the community will be good as well so with that being said um i've also created a projects thing uh which is basically just a way for me to keep track of things a little bit easier so there is a, a tab for bugs development uh, for what's in progress and what I'm doing and then there's feature requests will end up in here automatically uh, if you use the form on the um, the actual github so if you click on the get started it's already automatically going to put it in the features thing which will end up there so uh, you can just basically write your title here and then give me a description what your idea is and then for the bug one um, it's a little bit more a uh, few extra fields but basically describe what the issue is the um, steps to reproduce the issue so that's really important for me uh, in this box here make sure if there's any crash reports or anything like that to actually include that because i'll need to know what procedure and all that other stuff that i'll be looking crash logs are actually really um, helpful for me to narrow down the issues and stuff and then just basically the information for what build and it's currently out as a snapshot version not a actual release so keep this in mind that it's not designed for regular use at this very moment uh, when I get the first biome actually made, then we'll be going into alpha, which is sort of unstable still, but more stable and more designed for regular use. But right now it's currently really raw and not designed for it, so use it at your own risk. Um, it doesn't contain any viruses or anything like that, but it will be very buggy and I can't guarantee that it won't mess up worlds um if i change something uh currently so the other thing is you can find 
the snapshots and stuff like that on the release tab on the main uh, under code and then releases. You can click on releases and then it will give you all the general releases released. And I'll provide the uh, regular download, which is for regular Minecraft um, installations for Forge, as well as the uh, development one, this one. I can never pronounce what that says, but it's basically what you use in mCreator for testing for development and stuff. So there's two different versions. I also list all the changes that I've done there. So all the information that you need is on this page. And with that being said, there is one last thing I just quickly want to show you, and that would be the official um, mCreator page. So you can see that they're, it's all ready released and everything like that. That's the logo for the mod. I just quickly whipped that up for the um, thumbnail and stuff like that. And it has some of the better screenshots, like thumbnails that I basically took for the biome and some of the other features in it, like the kiln and the limestone that we worked on and all the other features. So if you want to download it through mCreator, you can do that as well. And uh, it will, there, I'll be providing snapshots. You can actually read to see if it's a snapshot or what right here. Um, it'll say regular snapshot or the, the basically a decompiled one uh, which is for the um, for development use so you can get those there and the changes are also on here for here uh, and it will say snapshot for the version right now it's in dev but we'll eventually get to a more stable version outside of that uh, um, that's all I have for today if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and I will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out Thank you.